Well, President Joe Biden is calling on all Americans to bring down the temperature in his first address to the nation since his vice president's election loss to his former political rival. That would be President-elect Donald Trump. Overnight, CBS News has added the key battleground state of Nevada of Trump's win column as his upcoming administration and policy agenda are starting to crystallize. CBS News' Jared Hill has more. We accept the choice the country made. In his first public remarks since Election Day, President Joe Biden assured Americans that there will be a peaceful transfer of power as his party grapples with major election losses. A defeat does not mean we are defeated. Democrats searching for answers have started pointing fingers. Our party is going to have some hard conversations in the coming weeks and months. Meanwhile, President-elect Trump's policy agenda as well as administration are starting to take shape as he looks to take office with a GOP-controlled Senate and possibly a Republican House. We're going to keep our promise. On his agenda, extending 2017 tax cuts, deregulation across federal agencies, and sweeping tariffs on imported goods. Trump's longtime aide, Stephen Miller, is leading talks on how to use executive orders to execute Trump's plan to deport more than 11 million undocumented immigrants. And yesterday, Trump announced a historic pick to a key White House post. Campaign manager Susie Wiles will serve as chief of staff, making her the first woman to ever hold the position. Jared Hill, CBS News, Washington.